Congratulations on the new Arctic Ecosystem Water. This is just a plastic shell. We're going to start backfilling it to lock it in place. If you don't have somebody standing inside of there, when you're backfilling it, you're going to knock it out of level. So your job is going to be not only just to stabilize it, but you're going to want to be looking at that and make sure that it's staying level. So when we're backfilling, it doesn't get knocked out of, yep, it doesn't get knocked out of position. So now let's take some of this loose soil and start filling in on this side. Um, leave that side open until we get the pipe in. things you want to think of. You want to make sure that both ends are clean. You want to clean off your uh, the pipe on one side and also make sure that your uh, your pipe connection or your um, MPT is clean as well. They want to be clean and want to be dry. A little bit of dust, a little moisture is going to cause trouble for you. So you want to clean all that stuff off. So what we're working with here, we're using a, a one part glue. You could do a regular glue and primer. The nice thing about this is a lot quicker um, and if it is slightly damp, this actually will hold for you. Um, but this also is designed specifically for this flexible PVC pipe. So some of your regular PVC glues and primers don't work well with this material. So you want to make sure you use the right one. So what we want to do is we're going to come in and clean it off. We both ends. <laughs> all right so we got most of the screws already in so what we want to do I recommend you can use power tools the only thing is until you get the feel for it I don't recommend it because it's, it's, it's too much speed and it strips them real fast and again it's only a dozen screws not that bad so you want to just start out so all the holes should be lined up so when you put it in you'll it'll feel kind of spongy you just want to start spinning that thing and it will pierce through the rubber liner that's why it's got this tapered tip on there and then once it catches that's it level it but it's just all a feel and thing. Plant it and then you want to go, you don't need to bury it, you just want to be a little bit yeah, snug yeah, and that's it. I mean, this is right. what will help. Yeah. Uh, so it's really good and tight. So what we want to do though, is we want to seal all those little joints. The water's gonna so we don't want any water going that way. Mm -hmm. So we're going to uh, seal this up. We will end up getting more soil back behind there. But what we're going to do is we're going to pull them all this stuff. We're gonna work our way around. Oh boy! Oh wow! It's a little warm down here. Yes, so when, it, when it's hot, it uh, it goes quicker. It expands out. Yeah. So we so all we got to do is get this joint right in between here. But that expands up a lot. Oh. So then what we'll do? Someone got a knife on them. So I'm coming in between this because I want to create a separate pool here and a uh, separate pool okay. here. Okay. So it doesn't flow in between. Yeah. It doesn't lose the water. And again, if it flows a little bit, I don't care. Right, but you don't want it underneath. Yeah. You want to see the flow. Start a 
concrete. Nice. It's gonna increase and meshes it together because this stuff is super strong. Yes. So this is gonna, the, the foam is gonna kind of infuse itself in there. And now you have a big monolithic piece that moves around. Oh. The other thing that, that it does, um, it protects the liner from it the gravel. Well, you could also you could put gravel on it instantly. So what I could do right now, we could dump gravel on here. A bag right here. Three, two, one. Dolly. Oh, yeah. Feel that pocket? Hit that edge. Yeah. That looks like it's always been there, guys. Wow. Let's see how much time do we have to spare? 20, 20 what, minutes. what time is it? It's 3 17. Okay, we got 13 minutes to spare. Let's yeah. pull out the beers. Who brought the beers? <laughs> Thank you so much. Tell those kids that said hi, we'll see you in Chicago. Oh yeah, we're definitely coming.